SR-72 Dark Star is no longer just a concept on a classified sketchboard it's fast becoming a reality, and 2025 is the year we're finally getting closer to seeing this hypersonic marvel come to life. Known as the Son of Blackbird, the SR-72 is Lockheed Martin's bold leap into the future of high-speed reconnaissance and strike capability. At the core of its mission, reach Mach 6, gather intelligence and vanish before the enemy even knows it's been there. Unlike traditional aircraft, the SR-72 is designed not just to outrun interceptors, but to outrun missiles themselves. It's powered by a revolutionary combined cycle propulsion system, a turbojet for low speeds, and a scramjet for hypersonic travel. This allows it to take off from a conventional runway and transition smoothly to hypersonic speeds. By reaching over 4,000 miles per hour, the Dark Star can cover distances faster than any drone or fighter in existence. .225 has been a turning point in the project's development, while much of the program remains under wraps. Several key indicators suggest we're inching closer to a full-scale prototype. Lockheed Martin's Skunk Works division, known for developing secretive and cutting-edge tech, has hinted at successful engine tests and subscale demonstrator flights. If the timeline holds, we could see an unmanned test flight by late 2025 or early 2026. What makes the SR-72 such a game-changer is its dual-role capability. While its predecessor, the SR-71 Blackbird, was limited to reconnaissance. The SR-72 is expected to be strike capable. It's designed to carry advanced precision munitions, possibly even hypersonic missiles, making it not just a watcher, but a hunter. With such capacity, it's no longer just a spy plane, it's a strategic weapon. The aircraft's stealth profile is also getting a futuristic upgrade. Early renders and leaked schematics suggest a sharply angled radar deflecting airframe optimized for thermal shielding and minimal cross-section. This means the SR-72 could cruise at the edge of space without being detected by current air defense networks. Combine that with real-time satellite communication and AI-driven data processing, and you've got an aircraft that doesn't just gather information it instantly delivers battlefield awareness. But with all this innovation, there are challenges too. Hypersonic flight introduces extreme heat loads on the aircraft's body, requiring advanced materials that can withstand temperatures exceeding 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit. Engineers are rumored to be using next-generation carbon composites and titanium alloys technologies that are still being pushed to the edge of their capabilities. Budget and secrecy are also major players in this story. While the Pentagon has not officially confirmed the SR-72's funding, there's ample evidence that black budget allocations have kept this project well-fed for over a decade. Statements from U.S. Air Force and DARPA officials have acknowledged the need for hypersonic ISR and strike platforms, and the SR-72 seems to check all the boxes. In the broader context of global military power, the SR-72 gives the United States a massive strategic edge, with adversaries like China and Russia developing their own hypersonic programs. The need for speed, stealth, and survivability has never been greater. The Dark Star represents the next frontier in American air dominance. For viewers who've followed our channel Military Might, this is exactly the kind of futuristic tech we love to explore. The SR-72 isn't just a successor to the Blackbird, it's a symbol of how warfare, intelligence, and aerospace are being redefined in the 21st century. As more details emerge,